lecture is on breathing and how breathing can affect your tone. When you're breathing improperly, too much air is coming out. And while the old saying goes, if you're really fat, it's because you eat too much fat. When you play and you have too much air, well, then your tone is airy. So breathing is very important to improving your tone. And if you can learn how not to use so much air when you play, your tone will get so much better. Usually you have tone coming out, but on all sides, all the way around your tone, this laser beam of tone is a whole bunch of air. And when you learn to hold it in and not use all that air, then what we do is we take off all those edges and leave just that laser beam of air. So if I'm playing and I'm just not worrying about my breathing, Yankee Doodle. Of course, that's how you played when you were young um, and you were just beginning flute because all this air was coming out. Over the years, you've probably learned to hold in some of that air just naturally, but you need to really know how to hold in the air, really understand in order to hold in enough. You're probably not holding in as much as you should or to compensate for all that air wanting to come out you've made this really tight. And we'll talk about the tight embouchure at another lecture. Right now, we just want to talk about breathing. So when you breathe properly, you then hold in the air. You don't let it out. And now only sound comes out. Quite a big difference between that and the sound I had when all the air was coming out. So let's talk about breathing in more depth in another lecture. But that's where you have to start. You have to start with breathing. So have fun. <laughs>